Police have dug up a West Perth backyard in the cold case murder investigation of a Perth mother. Lisa Brown disappeared two decades ago. Now detectives have returned to a property they've previously searched for a hunt to look for fresh clues. A suspected murder case more than two decades cold. 19-year-old Lisa Brown disappeared from the streets of Northbridge in 1998. Today, fresh clues led police back to a West Perth home that they first searched 20 years ago. A new tip-off from someone who told police they missed something. We were searching inside at that point and now our search has taken us to the rear of the premises. Tearing up the car street backyard, lifting entire slabs, searching what lies beneath. The Highgate sex worker leaves behind two children aged just two and four years old at the time of her disappearance. Her parents then and now desperate for answers. We will love her and you know and in time it's going to be hard on us on, on, on her children as well. Lisa Brown was last seen on Lake Street in Northbridge in the early hours of November 10, 1998. The 19 year old and her boyfriend were captured on security cameras at a Shell petrol station the night she disappeared. Soon after, police dredged the lake and searched Hyde Park looking for the mother of two's body, then scoured bushland in Eden Hill months later. Detectives offered a $250,000 reward in 2017 to help solve her suspected murder. That offer still stands. I think this is evidence of the fact that um, we don't give up. Um, we will continue to search for answers. And Jerry DeMassey is in West Perth tonight. Jerry, what's the latest from detectives? Well, Michael, they say they haven't found anything today, but police insiders tell me they did suspect that might be the case. You see, major cold case detectives did actually invite media to this search today, something that doesn't happen very often but is done with purpose because Nine News understands they are looking for a particular person, a person who they think might be able to help with this investigation, and it's their hope that the coverage of this West Perth property might encourage that person to come forward, which they can do so anonymously via Crime Stoppers and perhaps put an end to this 20-year cold case. Michael. Jerry, thank you. Jerry DeMassi reporting there from West Perth.